Rondo grabs the rebound, gets fouled by Lucas. It is a triple-double for Rajon Rondo. Wow. 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 Why would you ever trade that guy for a freaking llama from the Lakers? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Did you see the llama the other night? Yeah, well, yeah. yeah. I watched he him. He was pretty great. good. Yeah, he's always the game pretty good, but he's hairy, and he, you know, he should really be an NL You would Packer. love him if he were Celtic. No, not, not, not if I had to give up Rondo to get him, though. No, no, no. way. No, Rondo's uh, my guy there. He had 32 points, 15 assists, 10 rebounds. I will say this. speak to the media. Uh, yeah, after making them wait 75 yeah. minutes. Yeah. He can be a dancer. He's a diva. He is. Yeah. That is just rude. And I don't care if you make, you know, Dan Shaughnessy and Steve Bullpet wait. Uh, but is that necessary? No, you could tell him I'm not talking. You sure and he you did it on purpose? Great game. You have a great game. And you know they're waiting. Yeah. 75 Making minutes? a statement. Making a statement. Right. Trade rumors. What's he mad about? <clears throat> not making the All Star game. You think that's it? But they, you well, can't do the media. Steve Trade Bullpet. rumors. And people blaming him for the two losses to the Lakers and the Raptors. Uh, Played crap right. against the Raptors. Well, first of all, I, I wouldn't blame you know Steve Bullpett <clears throat> and Dan Shaughnessy. Secondly, I'd bl blame Doc Rivers. You want someone who blamed you, who, who walked on the damn court to ream you out <laughs> against Toronto, which was my favorite moment of Doc Rivers' coaching career. That was brilliant. Yeah. Rondo can certainly be childlike, but you know I'm, I'm I, I don't want him on another team. I'm not through. What did you think of that Friday night? Doc Rivers walking on the court. Yeah, I love Doc Rivers. He's good. He, and, he and, deals with and, stuff. And when they show the replay, you can see him. He's pissed. They're not moving. He was way out of they the court. They come out of the timeout, and they still don't move. They just stand around. And he says, enough. I'm surprised they didn't tee him up because he called the timeout when he was like 20 feet on the floor. <laughs> know. You know, looked like he was ready to, you know, play defense or something. And then he just reams these guys out. I've never, and, and Mike Gorman was incredulous. He's saying to Dickerson, Greg, have you ever seen that? Ever. I, I'm never. I'm, how long has Doc been here? Right. It, it was extreme, certainly. Uh, now, you, I don't know if you heard about the Laker game yesterday where they, they, they got a real break. They were up 16 points early in this game. And then late, they were down. They actually let uh, Toronto overtake them. They outplayed them for the last three quarters. And then Toronto can't inbound the ball. So Kobe hits the game winner with 4.2 seconds left. And you know I hate the Lakers more than almost anything. Uh, because... Do you hate the Bulls? Because the Bulls are a much bigger threat to your Celtics. No, I don't hate them as much. I I'll don't, say I... this. There were 17,000. What is the number in, in attendance? 17, no, 18,624 people there. I think just about all of them were disappointed. You know, not upset. Disappointed when they found out Derrick Rose wasn't sure. playing, wasn't even yeah. there. But Rondo was pretty happy. Uh, oh, it made his day. Uh, well, it, it sort of freed him up to have a triple double. They don't do this. They don't even come close to winning this game if Rose is playing. No, even probably if Rose not. Rose is hurting. Probably not. But they I, I don't. Blew it. They almost blew it with, you know, John Lucas the third. You know, and then uh, the third <laughs> and three, three now. Well, his and replacement, C.J. Watson, his replacement had twenty two points. Yeah, but he was eight for twenty three. Uh, Derrick Rose plays this game. It's ugly. It is another loss and uh, at home and Doc's throwing a tantrum and yeah. everybody's. Questioning this. Sports Radio WEEI, now on 93.7 FM in Boston.